Only been a few hours, but it felt like days Only been days, but it felt like months Only gone for a year, only go like once Life moves fast when you do what you want Start living, living my life and enjoying it more because I feel like you know, when you your mindset is just trained to make your money a grand, 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 which is nothing wrong with that because you you know you gotta have your money to basically survive. But I don't want to forget about living too. Like you. Queens and House of Kings doing this evening. How you all doing? Welcome to welcome or welcome back to the start of a new video. How you all doing? Your girl. When I say, I mean, when I say y'all, I'm tired. My energy level just low. I don't know. When I get through talking to you all, I'm gonna go on and take me a nice probably just gonna take me a nice shower. I just made it in not too long ago. I had to stop at Family Dollar, and then I had got off for of work. Work was great today. Girl, I ain't get this from Family Dollar, but. I had it in the bag, but um, I I love me a Gatorade. You never can go wrong with a Gatorade. But um, anyway, I did have to go up in there for um some some more of this um this little vagin seal. That I'm low. I was getting pretty low. I used the last of it up um when I be doing my shower and bath routines. So I like this can. I mean, I, I use it like this. I like the um, Summer's E, but I didn't see it in there. I hope this be pretty good because I'm so used to um, using like like an unscented brand, but it don't it don't smell bad. I ain't, it, it just, this is really not even a haul. I'm just showing you all. It ain't number little three little items I got out of there. And I've been seeing a lot of the queens on YouTube and reviewing this and this been on my eye i mean like i have seen this before at the Do family dollar it actually smells pretty good this palmer's coconut oil because i'm getting pretty low on my lotion i you pretty much use up most of my lotion and my shea butter so i'm getting pretty low but it smells pretty good you all this little palmer's yeah i've been seeing a lot of queens reviewing on youtube and i went in there uh oh boy and spit that I went in there. I don't know where this water come from. Let me throw this back. Oh, I might have came out of my from my. Um, Y'all yeah, have found me one of these. I ended up getting this out of Family Dollar. Yeah, when I say the Family Dollar, I feel like people be sleeping on. Like I say, the the when it come down like the with makeup, they say a makeup. And y'all know I've been buying. If I never revealed it to you all, I'm just revealing it now. I've been buying like a lot of my makeup products from the for the last three to four years now from out of like the family dollar store every now and then I might, you know, get some foundation out of Walgreens. But most times since my budget, like my finances is real, real tight right now. And I just really been on a strict budget. I just found this out of um, family dollar. And I think this was like nine, 10 for this, this, and this was like, I'm trying to figure out this. This was just $20 for three items. I said, <laughs> I said stuff is really getting expensive because I think this was like five dollars. This was nine, and I think this was like five dollars. But it is what it is because I really needed this, especially this right here. This I definitely needed this. So uh, this is the foundation because I told y'all I was getting pretty low on it. Like they had, it was a foundation I was really um, that really caught my attention, but I felt like it was a little too dark for my shade. So I'm like, nah, I just go on and stick with this one right here. But it was a much bigger size than this. But I think I seen that same foundation on eBay. I had already did me a little small eBay cart for, cause I mean, I'm gonna give me some more. I'm give me another foundation. I'm gonna give me what else? I need to get. I need to get some cons not concealer. I need to get some the eyeshadow. I mean the uh, uh, not eyeshadow, y'all. Mascara, I got some prime on my eBay card and two pencils. So I'm still gonna get that. And that'll be like a little nutter when I do order it and show you all. I think I'm gonna get that from um eBay. But yeah, you all, I just want to kind of come in and start the vlog off. I'm just beginning of a new vlog. Um I do work tomorrow. So tomorrow I work and then I'll be out the next I'll be out Wednesday and Thursday. 
And then your girl be pretty much getting prepared for my sister's baby shower. The baby shower, that will be a separate vlog. I was trying to see, should I go YouTube live for her baby shower? It, I don't know. It just depends on how I'm feeling that day. Because I know we, her baby shower going to be held here at the house. And there, there is going to be a lot of, well, I don't know if it's going to be a lot of people. But it just depends. I might go YouTube live and do it. Or I might just, you know film it with you know with the camera and just put it together but some keep telling me i should do a youtube lab that way i don't have to really worry about doing too much of an edit but we'll see you all because i did want it to get much footage as possible uh with the lab because i know you go youtube lab it can be uh, it can probably be extended to an hour of vlog if i want to so we'll see but yeah, I just want to come in because your girl just, I don't know, my energy level, it's just like it's just been pretty low for these last couple of days. I don't know. I was telling my friend, I might need to get on, give me a start. I mean, I might need to take a multivitamin or something. I need to probably get on some vitamins because like, it's like lady, I, I just haven't really been feeling too good. I really wanted to make me a... I don't know why I really wanted to make me a drink today, but I I guess I'm going to have to pass on it because my, my stomach just, I don't know, I don't feel too good. So I probably just make me a little drink tomorrow, have me some apple vodka in the, in the cooler. I mean, not in the cooler. I had bought me some apple vodka probably like over a month ago when I still got some. And so I um I know I'm like to make me a little drink out of like pour some in a cup and add me like, you know, maybe some juice or something or a soda to mix because it had like a, tart taste to me because i'm not really a drinker like i said i don't really drink i uh, drink a lot i just special occasions or if it's been one of them, like a rough day or something at work and i just want to relax my mind because normally i like to have wine on hand but i don't even got wine so i just said i might just you know probably just about gonna take this take me a nice nice shower where i'll probably be re refreshed but i really i really should take me a nice warm bath where i can sit in the water but We'll see what I get into. But yeah, I just want to come in and start this vlog off and say how you all doing. And I just recently uploaded a uh, Get Ready With Me video this morning because I got to try to get back on my consistent, cons being consistent. Yeah, I feel like I really haven't gave y'all a vlog in like three days ago. So I just created this little short video this morning. Uh, me getting ready for work. It's a realistic work morning routine for me. Uh, uh, I get normally it's a 4 a.m. morning routine. 4 a.m. morning routine preparing me for my 6 a.m. work schedule. So yeah, I uh, upload that video just now. But yeah, you all, I just want to come in and start the video off and just, you know, see how you all doing and say hi. When it been a few hours, when it's been like days. Yeah, I queens and handsome kings doing this evening how you all doing welcome or welcome back to another day in a new video how you all doing i don't know i like how my little ass shadow came out today i was trying to go for more like a pink purple smoky eye this morning this was like my little makeup i did have to work today <sighs> so this was my little work work makeup day to day for me i mean my little make i mean what's my little mate my little work makeup routine y'all know i switched my ass shadow my ass shadows up pretty much a lot at first i was going more for like a light blue neutral but then i did like some purple and pink so i just be trying to play around with the ass shadow palette when i'm applying my makeup it's like lady I have became extremely obsessed with doing makeup lately. And I think I might, I'm going to just go on and bring it out as content. Go on to apply more makeup videos to my channel. Because I noticed even with 
uh, me doing the routines, I will get a view just as quick, you know, of a makeup routine. So, I mean, I'm going to reintroduce makeup routines back on my channel. So, yeah, I just wanted to, you know, um, let you all know that. But, yeah, the girl just sitting up here drinking on a cup of um, tea. It's not the best. It's some Lipton tea. Uh, I had a cup of tea. I mean, I had a tea package, a herbal tea that my coworker had gave me today. And I told her I wanted to try it. So she brought me a little tea pack. And I don't know, for some reason, it got called up into my apron. Like I had it down in my apron. And you all know the little string. But this is some Lipton tea right here I'm drinking. It's not the best, but I'm going to drink it down one. This like right here of the tea bag must have caught up into my zipper, and so when I tried to open it up at the package, it came in. It just exploded everywhere. So now I'm sitting up here stuck with drinking on some Lipton tea right now. I said, "Boy, I tell you." So next time I work with her, I'm gonna have to um, ask her where she purchased that tea from, so I can give me a box of it. But I know I've been hearing the stress, the stress yoga tea. I, I think I have seen a couple creators maybe review drink that tea or show it in their vlogs i have heard it's come in a yellow box i said I'm, i am want to try that because i have seen it when i used to shop at city market but yes it's a little market store i'm in the downtown area not too far from where i work at called city market and i used to go there a lot back in the day and just you know if they have fresh fruits sometimes i would go in there and get like coffee creamer milk you know parfaits or smoothies whatever they carry i use to go get i haven't been in there in a while and i know they i have seen the tea there before so i think i'm gonna probably if i don't get out i might just order it off of amazon because i know amazon carry it too mm. this tea y'all is really <laughs> i don't know lift the tea i don't know maybe i should have probably put a little bit more sugar in it but hmm I think I'm when I get to talk to you all, I'm gonna have to add some more sugar to that because it's just not it's not hitting on none. Because normally I prefer honey in my tea. I'm just drink my water till I get to talk to you all because I really need to add some sugar and reheat it up. I was reading. Yeah, that tea kind of looked tired for me. I was reading this book right here. I have read this before called The Great Is You by Trent Shelton. I had ordered this book, I think, in 20, 2020, 2021, I think it was. And this would be my second time reading. I was telling y'all, since fall coming in, I want to start reading more, reading more books on this journey that I'm taking, this spiritual, mental, you know, physical journey that I've been telling you all I've been on for the last two years now. So I do want to include more reading in my... Um, in my, you know, routines, y'all know most time when y'all see me um, in the mornings, on the days I'm out reading my Bible. So this, because this actually is evening right now. Um, it's actually probably, it might be like one on one thirty last time I checked. Because y'all know I told y'all that I, I usually have to check the time. And now on my phone that I'm currently vlogging from, uh, um, yeah, I think it was like one thirty, But yeah, I just want to reread this and just you know uh, get more of an understanding i kind of read it before and he just talked a lot about his personal life and they're very inspiring young man you all probably heard me talk about trent shelter plenty of times if you've been following me for quite some time you all have probably seen me in my vlogs i probably will share like a little clip of him speaking or y'all might have heard me you know just talking about him in general he's very inspiring always encouraging and i really enjoy listening to him he's like one of the top motivational speakers i think there is out there i know there's quite a few um les brown he's pretty good i have heard of les brown um tony gaskins it's quite a few motivational speakers that i, I will listen to but yeah you are i'm just sitting here i'm just sitting here looking out the window um before I toned in with you all, but you all seen me reading that book. So I'm um, actually be reading the second page when I get through. So I think I'm going to promise myself if I can read three or four pages a day out the book, I'm not going to promise myself saying I'm, I'm going to read a whole, ch even if I can't read a whole chapter. But if I can read, like, because I read it before, it just, I want to do another reread. I probably read a couple more pages when I get through talking to you all. And then I probably just 
get ready and just chill out and relax. Cause I, uh, like I said, I did work this morning. <sighs> it just took me a nice shower not too long ago. Fall is really approaching, which is my favorite thing. I'm about ready for some hot chocolate. When I say, I wish I would have order me some hot chocolate when I did my Instacart back here. I'm so ready for some hot chocolate. I haven't had hot chocolate Ooh, probably since I think the last time I made some hot chocolate was at work because we do have a little espresso latte machine that we use against like you can stain milk and you know make like hot chocolate from scratch there. I think that was like maybe about three or four weeks ago when I made a hot chocolate. Cause normally when I'm at work, I always drink like either iced coffee or recent or iced chai tea latte. So yeah, but, um, the water good. I don't know tomorrow. It, it, I'm, I'm thinking about making me a warm cup of coffee. I probably just brew me a big pot of coffee. I may brew me some coffee in the morning. I might skip on ice tomorrow and just make me like a nice warm cup of coffee. I haven't had a warm cup of coffee in a while now. Like mostly in the summer, I crave a lot of iced coffee, but sometimes during when the season changes, you know, to the fall, I will still drink iced coffee. But when it starts getting more colder, I would prefer a warm cup in the house. You know, it just, it just depends. But yeah, it might make me a nice warm cup of coffee because I still got that hazelnut creamer. And yeah, just just give it like a little vibe set up. Just 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 get that fall vibes in. So I probably just make me a warm cup of coffee. But overall, it's been a great day. I'm just looking at the leaves. I'm yeah, I know when I'm looking at this way, I'm looking at the window. I don't know, just something about that natural lighting. It just give me a sense of peace. And then especially for it to be the evening time, it's just even prettier. I almost made me wish I would have came on camera and showed y'all how I did this makeup look. But I think I probably, I think the goal is for this today, for this week or for these next couple of days, because I'm out t uh, tomorrow, which is Wednesday and Thursday. My goal is to try to, you know, try to squeeze two videos out this week. And then... I know my sister's baby shower this Saturday, this coming Saturday, so that'll be that vlog because I gotta y'all know I gotta work on that video. That video probably won't go out to sometime next week, or it just depends. Now, um, I probably just try to stretch that video for the following week because I'm still trying to debate on if I want to go live and do it, or just go you know do my normal routine. But like I say, real see, I think I was mentioning that to you all yesterday. But yeah, I'm just sitting here. Um, I just said I'm a werewolf in my werewolf in my closet. I um, was supposed to have order. I was on Amazon looking at some nice little dresses you can wear for a baby shower attire. But I don't. I'm not gonna buy me buy me none. I'm not even worried about. It. I'm just gonna uh, wear what I got in my closet or something. Yeah, I got I got two options. I can either dress casual. Well, I'm I'm dressed casual either way. I, go. I probably just wear. I got like this little jumper. It's cute little jumper. Um, got like blue in it. You know, represented uh, baby shower. Cause I do need to do a Dollar Tree haul when I do um, this upcoming week. Probably this Thursday. I need to do a Dollar Tree haul because I got some items on there for her for uh, for me to decorate to get some balloons and um, some little stuff, you know, to decorate and make it look real pretty. So, yeah, I think I'm going to do that because I was going to get off of Amazon. Amazon had this little arch where you can, it come with like over 100 balloons and you can just decorate the arch real pretty. You all probably have seen it if, if you, you know, baby showers or even birthdays. Some people, ha I have seen people have those arches made on their, you know, birthdays. I have seen people have those arches like uh, made when it's their birthday as well, just as well as baby showers. But yeah, I think I'm just going to go the, the cheapest way out and just, you know, kind of make my own little arch at home. And, or if not make it here, just get the, um, just order some balloons, get the balloons, hopefully, because I already got everything on my cart uh, with Instacart. All I got to do just uh just pay for it yeah because normally what i do when i um get my i have my items to my cart i use just save them until it's time for me to check off and then that way i go from there but yeah i'm just sitting here getting prepared for that ready for that and then my daughter uh but the, the day before that i got to get ready my daughter got a doctor's appointment so yeah girl ain't got too much going on but that two events and then 
I had looked before I left work today. We do got two banquets coming up this month on the 22nd of October and the 26th. So uh, most likely I know I'm going to work them. But, um, yeah, so that's the agenda for this the rest of this month. Like, I don't really got much going on. But like I say, I'm, when I say I'm so ready for a vacation, I think when it starts getting a little bit slow, I'm going to try to um, probably just try to do me like a little staycation somewhere here in, in the city, here in Memphis. Yeah, but I'm ready for me a vacation. That's why I say the next go around when my PTO come up, I'm going to start taking advantage of that and just, you know, if I need some days off, even though the off days be fine, but it's nothing like taking advantage of that PTO where you can get paid to be off paid time. You know, PTO, y'all yeah, know PTO, paid time off. But yeah, I'm going to start taking advantage of that because I remember when I was at my last job, I didn't really get any breaks. It's like I went from the last job to this job and it's just, I just been working every since. So, I need to start taking advantage of these opportunities instead of just letting my PTO roll over. Like I say, this I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna let that happen with this job. When that PTO come around, I'm gonna take advantage of it. Even if I get vacation up, I'm I gotta start taking advantage of that because like I say, it's it's just time for me to start living living my life and enjoying it more because I feel like you know, when you your mindset is just trained to make your money a grand, 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 which is nothing wrong with that because you you know you gotta have your money to basically survive. But I don't want to forget about living too. Like you gotta live your life too because, like I say, my everyday routine, the days I'm scheduled to work is mostly work, get ready for work, go home, don't do nothing. Then the next day, if I gotta work, get ready to go for work, go. I don't want to keep living like that. I said, no, nah, I got to try to find some type of ways to enjoy my life. Like I said, I'm not old yet. I'm no near, I'm not even near my 50. So it's it's time for me to just, and even 50, not old, but I'm just saying I'm not up there yet. You know, I'm still the young woman and I got to, you know, get out and enjoy my life. But yeah, that's why most times like I go to different parts, but it'd be some days where I do want to go out to eat. So, I mean, it just depends, but I know uh, with the holidays coming up, um, I'm not going to be doing, like I say, I'll be trying to be careful on, cause like I say, the restaurants have got really expensive these days. I don't know. It's like, you just, but it's a couple of places here that I've been wanting to check out, uh, far as the dine in, but like I say, I, I real see, real see, but, um, yeah, it's, it's just time to enjoy. But yeah, you all, I ain't going to ramble too much. I just wanted to come in and introduce another day in this video.